Good morning and welcome to The Space, a podcast that wants to shrink all of your worries. I'm Casey Donovan, alongside our writer Amy Malloy. On Thursdays, our theme is all about you, with mindfulness tips to feel like your best self. When was the last time you just walked somewhere without doing anything else? We're not talking about a few steps to the bathroom. We're talking about walking to the shops, between your car and the supermarket, all the way to work. When was the last time you focused without any distractions? No podcasts, no scrolling, no streaming, no phone calls. We love walking and talking just as much as the next person. But don't you ever just miss walking without an extra layer of doing? According to research, distracted walking injuries are on the rise. We're so distracted, we're doing ourselves an injury. And here's the really worrying part. 52% of distracted walking incidents involving mobile phones happen at home. We are so distracted, we can't walk to the kitchen without smashing into the table. Mm, That's not a good look for us. On the flip side, mindful walking has been shown to create feelings of well-being, provide better sleep, improve mood and manage stress. You don't even have to leave your house. Our challenge to you is to walk mindfully around your home. Leave your phone in the kitchen when you're walking to the bathroom. Stop scrolling on route between your bedroom and bathroom. Take out your headphones when you empty the rubbish bin. You can make it down the driveway without the distraction. Now, as you move around, engage with your senses. Notice one thing you see. One thing you can hear. One thing you can smell. One thing you can feel. This is the easiest route to mindfulness. Find that little brief stroll. You're living in the moment. And it will get easier with practice. You might find it's even addictive. Before you know it, you'll be running on the treadmill without anything to listen to. We know it sounds weird. For now, let's focus on the baby steps. Pun intended. If we can stop hitting our own toes in our own homes, that would be a victory. I'm Casey Donovan, and you've been listening to The Space a podcast written by Amy Malloy. We're back tonight with another mood-soothing episode. Want to stop yelling? Cluck like a chicken. You don't want to miss this. Space out.